everyone so I am back with another sit down video I just looked at my window and it's a freaking blizzard outside anyways <laughs> welcome to Canada okay so today I am doing the get to know me tag um, I was tagged by my friend Katie from greenish Katie and she just emailed me all the uh, questions so I'm gonna just go through them if you hear any crazy music or like rattling or anything Colton's right over there and it's like extra saucer thing yeah. so uh, he said yeah <laughs> so um, that's what any music or noise is coming that's what it is anyways let's get into the question so um, are you named after anyone um, no um, Nicole I, as far as I know my mom just liked the name and um, my middle name is Elizabeth and we'll just pretend that I was like named after the Queen or something but I actually wasn't <laughs> um, number two is where are you from so I live in Canada obviously um, I live in uh, Ontario like in the province of Ontario um, and I live in a city called Hamilton which is about an hour away from Toronto and about 45 minutes to an hour away from the border to go across over to Buffalo, New York or Niagara Falls, New York. Um, which of your parents are you more like? Um, both, which is weird. Um, I look a lot like my mom, which everyone always says. Um, my mom and I are alike that we have a lot of the same health issues, which is hilarious. Um, we are, we have a lot of the same personality, but um, my really strong personality traits are like my dad and his side of the family. Um, some of us are pretty like outgoing and we have loud, like or we have loud opinions and um, we're stubborn and so it's a lot more like my dad's side. Um, what is your favorite food? So my favorite food is poutine and that just shows my Canadian-ness. Um, basically, it's french fries with gravy and cheese curds, which I know some people say it sounds disgusting, but it's really good and the cheese curds kind of melt a little bit into the gravy and it's so good and I could literally eat that every day of my life. Or <laughs> I really like like chicken Caesar wraps, like something like that, like any kind of wrap with like cheese and chicken and like lettuce with like ranch or Caesar dressing, something like that. I could eat those every day too. Um, what is your favorite childhood memory? Um, I have a lot of childhood memories. Um, my grandma was like one of my best friends. My mom's mom was one of my best friends. And so I cherish a lot of my memories with her and things that we used to do because she died when I was pretty young. And so a lot of the things that I did with her like stick in my head even though maybe like if I had more time with her they would be less significant um, because we would have other memories but because I only had a short time with her they're like larger memories um, so even just stupid little things like I don't know she bought me this like tank top at the gap one time and I still have the tank top to this day and like I just thought I was so cool because my girl bought me this tank top at the gap or like the time I slept over at her house and um, my favorite food used to be um, like Chinese rice, which I still eat a lot of now. And she once bought me like an entire tub of Chinese rice and I ate it like the whole time I was at her house when I slept over. Like just stupid things like that. Um, but my family, we also went to um, Disney World. Um, it was me and my parents and my sister and my aunt, uncle and my cousin and we all drove down in a van all together. Uh, and that was my first and only trip to Disney World. I think I was 12, 11 or 12, and that it was just awesome. I still remember pretty much everything about it to this day. Um, I'm sorry for all the ums too. Uh, <laughs> what is your favorite pastime? My favorite pastime, um, I like to, I like to watch YouTube, honestly. That's so ridiculous. We don't have cable because like we didn't really watch much cable. The only thing we watched on cable was sports, hockey mostly. Again, sorry, I'm so Canadian. Um, so we actually canceled our cable. So all we watch is like Netflix, like Amazon Prime, Crave TV, which is like a Canadian Netflix. And I watch YouTube like forever. And um, that's probably my like favorite pastime. 
Uh, I also, I love spending time with my family. I have a seven month old son now, and so it's fun to like watch him grow up and it's gonna be so much more fun when he is a little older and it's actually like doing things and into things. So I like that and um, and like my actual, like my larger extended family, um, you know, we have, I have a lot of cousins and so we like going and watching their hockey games or their football games and their dance recitals and stuff. I love that kind of stuff. What is your favorite snack? Um, hold on. <laughs> Lay's sour cream and onion chips. Those are my favorite. I was actually just eating these because I haven't had lunch today because Colton has a nap, which if you follow me on Instagram, you'll have seen that on my uh, Instagram story. But my favorite snack is Lay's sour cream and onion chips with um, Pepsi with ice. I used to hate ice until I got pregnant and then I became obsessed with ice and now I'm still obsessed with ice. My, what is your favorite sports team? So I guess, like I like a lot of different sports. That's another thing that I'm kind of more like my dad. Um, I'm, I'm not like tomboyish in the sense of like, you know, going out and like getting dirty in the mud and stuff and I'm really not good at sports, but I love watching sports. So I guess I'll go through all the types of sports of my favorite sports teams. So football, um, I have two favorites. So for CFL, which is the Canadian Football League, I like the Hamilton Tiger Cats. And NFL, I like the Washington Redskins. Um, for hockey, I like the Vancouver Canucks. Um, and I also like the Nashville Predators. Um, if I was ever to go to Nashville, I really want to go to a Nashville Predators game. Um, baseball, the Toronto Blue Jays, obviously. Um, what else do I have? Basketball, I guess, would be the Toronto Raptors. I've never, oh yes, I have been to a game. I've been to a game and then it also, they do like a thing outside if they're in the playoffs and you can go watch outside of the thing and I did that, that was so fun. Um, and soccer or football, um, I like the, it's a Scottish team called uh, Celtic and the Celtic Football Club and I like them. Um, what else? Do you prefer cats or dogs? Um, both. I have one of each. Um, I don't really have a preference, I feel like. Uh, I had a dog when I was really little and he semi-attacked me. He like chewed on my arm, like not chewed on my arm, but like kind of scratched up my arm and he like, like messed up so much off my parents' house and they ended up giving him to someone else because he was just completely untrainable, unfortunately. Um, and then we had cats for a while and then my parents got a dog when I was in college and she unfortunately passed away um, a, a few years ago. I don't even know how many years ago that was. Um, and then Kenny and I, we have a dog and a cat. And so I don't really have a preference. I like both, honestly. Um, it's really more, I guess, maybe like the types of dogs and cats. Um, I like smaller dogs rather than large dogs and we actually have a lab, but she's on the smaller side, so that's good. Um, are you scared of heights? Yes and no. Um, like I'm not like climbing any buildings anytime soon or doing like the ed edge walk at like the CN Tower, but like I'll go on like roller coasters. Um, what is the first book you ever read? I have no idea. I loved books when I was a kid. Um, that's a hard question because I've read like a million books. The first book I ever read. I don't know. Maybe I'll do what was my what's my favorite book. <laughs> um, my favorite book is actually a Mitch Albom book, uh, which is also my dad's favorite author, um, and it's called The Five People Meet You Meet in Heaven. And I'm not the most religious person like on the planet, but um, the book is a really sweet book. Um, what is your favorite music genre? Country, hands down. Uh, in another life, I think that I'm actually from the south. <laughs> just because a lot of the things I do are like kind of southern and I absolutely love country music. I grew up listening to country music. I still listen to country music. I listen to pretty much any genre. I like rock too, um, pop and I love rap. I'm, I'm actually a pretty good rapper. Um, <laughs> but country music hands down is my absolute favorite kind of music ever. What was your favorite subject in school? Geography? Yeah, geography. I went to school, I went to college to, I wanted to be a travel agent and then I changed my mind. Um, 
but my main reasoning for going to college for that was because I was really good at geography. Hey, <laughs> um, do you have any tattoos? I don't, and I do want some. I have a few like ideas of ones I want. I'm just way too chicken and way too cheap. Um, what do you think is your best physical feature? That's hard. I don't, I don't know. My best physical feature. I would used to say like my stomach and like my waist and stuff, but after having a baby, it's definitely not. Um, my best physical feature, I don't know. Is it like stupid to say my face maybe? I don't know. I hate my nose though. I absolutely hate my nose. Um, I have kind of nice legs, I guess though. I, I have like pretty long legs. That's a hard question. These are hard questions, Katie. Um, and the last one is, what is your biggest accomplishment? Oh, I'm sure that you heard that. Um, my biggest accomplishment, and I'm like totally okay with saying this, and I know some people like take it braggy, but it's not braggy though, no one handed me what I have. But I, the house that I'm literally sitting in right now, my fiance and I, we bought this ourselves, and I was 22 years old when I bought a house. Um, I went to college, my parents were amazing and graciously paid for me to go to college. Um, and so I had the opportunity afterwards to work and save my money. And <laughs> he's making like fart noises. Um, I had the opportunity to work and save my money. I did obviously pay my own bills. I had like a cell phone bill and food and stuff. And I paid a little bit of rent to my mom for being in her house and like using her shower and like her washing my laundry because she was like anal about doing laundry. Um, but I saved my money and I bought a house at the age of 22 and not many people maybe around here I, like I know that there are people who buy houses that young or younger but um, yeah I don't I personally don't know anyone I don't think that bought their own house at the age of 22 so pat on my own back I don't know yeah so that was the get to know me tag so thank you so much Katie for tagging me and sending me the questions um, and I tag all of you who want to try it out. Let me know if you try out this tag and I would love to watch it and get to know you better. What are you doing? If you are new to my channel and you haven't subscribed yet, make sure you hit that red button down below and you can see all my videos. We'd love to have you in our little YouTube family. And if you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up so I know and leave any comments down below of anything you guys would like to see coming up on my channel. Thanks so much for watching guys and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!